Kikis, it's your girl KBK doing another video. Today is day number two of Writer's Prompt. And before we get into this video, make sure you like, subscribe, don't forget to comment down below on which part of the video you like. And don't forget to hit my, all of my social media pages that will be all linked down in the description box below. And go check out my, definitely check out my TikTok, my Instagram, and all that stuff. And before we get into this video, just go ahead and check it out. I'll wait, I'll wait. The sun is bright right now, like, it's giving me a nice glow, but it's hurting my eyes a little bit. So I'm like squinting a lot, so that's why you see me screen. You can see a bunch better if I do it like this way, but. We're still shining, still cute. But yeah, go check out my social media pages and let's get into this video. Music licensing reimagined. Artless I.O. Okay, so day number two is definitely talking about cleaning. And cleaning for me is definitely like a lot, a lot of things. Like since little, I was not a very good cleaner. But I had to clean because I don't deal with anything. Well, I really wasn't a cleaner as much. Like, I was a mess. I like mess. I like when I play with dolls and toys and stuff. I usually keep them in a mess. And until my room gets super messy, like, you know, um, order status, it got like that. So, I haven't been told to clean my room. And basically, that kind of like instilled in me to be like more clean. And like, even though when I was little, I did clean a little bit, but not as much. So, now that I'm starting like transition to over and over of uh, getting older, like since like after I started growing up a bit and understanding that some of the reasons why it's clean is to keep your house like looking nice and it, I like my stuff to look nice and stuff. Like say for instance my room or have my stuff in positions to work that be looking nice. Like I like my stuff like say if I get something on my birthday or something or Christmas or anything or well, since I don't celebrate Christmas no more, but for instance, like just physically or just visualize. Like I usually clean and keep my stuff in mid condition. Like I will not take my stuff out the box until I'm ready to play with it. But until then, I will keep it in the box, make sure everything's still nice, and, and make sure it doesn't collect dust or anything. Yeah, that's how kind of type of stuff I will do with my stuff. But I understand that. It can't be just always your stuff. You gotta be cleaning like the whole house and stuff. Like I, I don't know when I when I started washing dishes. I started washing dishes since how long was I was in the other house? I think five? Not five? No, not five. I think I want to say eight or nine. Eight or nine? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know for sure. I don't know that date when I started washing dishes, but I know it was somewhere around there when it was like. But I know it was somewhere around there when it was like. When I could speak and talk, since full sentences, I know that for sure. Yeah, I started cleaning and like doing dishes around that time and also learning that I need to start being less messy because 
it was just like the principle of like if you have a messy house you're like that like along the way when you grow up and older and your house is starting to get more messy and instead of being like messy all the time you want your stuff to look presentable or very elegant for others like not just even for others for yourself too like it's like the same way you treat yourself now is the same way you're gonna treat yourself in the future like for instance like if my room stays a mess like how I usually would like if I didn't like learn to start cleaning or understand the just the principles of clean because like if you clean you feel like not only do your stuff look nice or your room look nice but you will also feel great inside like like for instance when like I like keep my room clean like everything's organized everything is starting like in the right places and stuff it basically kind of like feels so fresh and you want to be able to you don't want to be like you want to be in there but you don't want to be like messing up and stuff like you just want to be like feeling good and stuff you just want to wake up every day feeling like that but if you're really messy you just want to feel like you're slump feel like depressed you feel icky by yourself and you don't want to get up and be motivated to do anything so that's why i like kind of, that's the before i was not a cleaner i was more of like a messer or have my stuff messy but that's when i started learning that but after that i started learning that cleaning is actually like good essential to learn and plus when i started like getting older and started cleaning up the house and stuff like getting more and more and helpful around the house and we started learning a lot because even certain stuff you guys would not know until now about why I But if you will learn that about now or like, you'll be super shocked at how like there's a reasons why to be clean. Like I will tell you, but I don't think you guys are ready for that. But just so you know, if you couldn't keep your house clean and organized, you feel good. If you don't, you feel like trash or you feel like exactly what you have messing around. You feel unmotivated, won't do anything, you won't keep yourself circling, so that's why you gotta keep your house clean and feel good. So our baseline was oh comment down below guys if you guys dislike cleaning or like cleaning or love cleaning. Because for me it was the start beginning of disliking then it was starting to like I don't love cleaning but I love like the best I do like the the great reasons why Not a strict schedule, but a schedule for you to be able to do, like, say, you get up at round five, okay? That's when you start cleaning up your main area that's in your room, like, say, make a bed, um, clean up a little bit, like, say, if you have, like, your pillows thrown on the floor or your shoes everywhere, just go ahead, just pick it up. All I gotta do is, for me, since I do the, since I clean, like, how my favorite number is, like, say, in my room, I have, like, eight trash around my room. Because since my favorite number is eight, I clean up eight things. Like, I clean up everything. So that would be like, okay, at least I can't say I didn't do my room. I did a little bit of my room. Like, first, number one is make my bed. Two, pick up trash around my room, which has probably, like, helped up to get to four things. And th um, five, I clean, make my desk. Then I do put up my laundry, which is that it's going to be somewhere around there, probably seven. And then the final number eight is definitely to put up my shoes. Because sometimes I leave my shoes around because they're going to put up the next day. But even if you have like that split second of time to clean up your mess, go ahead and do it because that helps keep yourself organized and motivated. Like since you come right back at home, let's like, say you got to work or you got to like came home from school or something like that, if you have that split second of time when you walk in. Make sure you just go ahead and be. Go ahead. Just put a 
up your stuff as you go along when you do stuff. <laughs> what are you doing? Okay, but long. <laughs> but as long as you just keep going ahead and like pub your stuff as you go along, like say, keep your clothes and shoes put up in my right natural state as you walk around, you'll feel a lot fresh. Like you won't have to be like come back and like pub your stuff. As long as you put it up right then, we have a split second to do it. Go ahead and put it up. And also when you like you um, say if you have dishes to see, go ahead and wash those dishes like they ain't gonna hurt you. Just go ahead and, even though you like you want to relax and unwind. Just trust me, the time you save to go ahead and wash them or clothes, wash clothes or whatever, like wipe, wipe the windows, wipe the doors, whatever you do, just take that split second out of the time that you've gotta go ahead and sit down and relax. Cause by the time when you go sit down and relax, you don't look like okay and start thinking like stressing out like I gotta go put these clothes up, I have to go wash the dishes, I have to go wipe the walls. But you already did that previous, like when you was like already drained, but just go ahead and do it. When you finally sit down and relax, you don't have to stress about that. And right now, all I can do is soak in the smell of like lavender or whatever spray you put on. Just gonna have to soak that up, but yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, don't forget to comment down below which part of the video you like. And don't forget to hit that little bell to know if I post a video. And comment down below if you guys dislike cleaning, like cleaning, or you just like it in general, or you love cleaning, or you was one of those people that didn't like cleaning but ended up loving cleaning, or you love cleaning at the beginning. I want to know, so just comment down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, kitties. Kitty out. Skirt. Skirt. Pull up the skirt.